Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode. Here is Van Amsen. Today we are going to dive deep into the world of binary trees and arrays. We got a fascinating problem on head converting a sorted array to binary search tree. One of uh, top 100 uh, problem on lead code. So let's dive. Uh, to give you a brief idea, a binary search tree is a tree in which all the nodes follow a property. The left child is less than the parent node and the right child is greater. And our mission today is to create such a tree from a sorted array. But uh, before we start, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you never miss uh, an update from us. Also, if you find the video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. So. Here is the problem. We have an integer array nums sorted in ascending order, and we have to convert it uh, into a high balance binary search tree. So remember, I, a high balance tree is a tree where the left and right subtree of every node uh, differ in height by no more than one. So here's an example. Uh, if uh, we have an array minus 10, minus 3, 0, 5, 9, our output can be a tree with root 0, left child minus uh, 10, and right child minus 5, and so on. So we'll uh, get into this in a bit. So now let's talk uh, about solution. So our approach here will be to uh, involve recursion. So you know why uh, we can use here recursion? It's because it often allows us to break down complex problem into simpler, more manageable parts. So the main idea is to find the uh, middle element of the array. And this middle element will become the root of our binary search tree. Uh, why middle? Because it ensures that the tree will remain balance. So the left half of the array will be used to build the left subtree and similarly the right half uh, for the right subtree. And we then recursively construct these subtrees. So uh, let's dive into the code and uh, implement it. Uh, so starting from if not num, then we return known. And mid will be len of nums modulo divided by two, create node and construct subtree. So node will be three node num middle and node left will be self sorted array to bs num mid and node right self sorted array to bst num mid plus one and we return the node so let's run our uh, code and see if it's working so yeah it's working for a given test case we have uh, successfully created uh, expected binary tree. So yeah, and there we have it. Our sorted array is now a balanced tree. Uh, so let's test uh, our code with some unsynthesized cases. I'm submitting it, its first implementation, but hopefully it will work, yeah. So first implementation and we beat 76% with respect to runtime and also 50% with respect to memory. So all good and yeah. That's it for today. I hope you found this video helpful. And remember, the best way to learn is to do. So make sure uh, you code along and practice this problem on your own. And if you have any question or doubts, or if there are any specific problem you want me to cover in the future videos, uh, drop a comment below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more exciting content. Happy coding and we will see you in the next one.